Hi everyone, I'm just going to do a quick video doing a tour of this hotel I'm currently staying at, this Japanese traditional hotel. So at the end of that corridor is the Ofudo, the bar, I'm not going to record there for obvious reasons. Um, to the left here is a corridor and up those stairs are more bedrooms, so I'm going to have to rush this video because my camera's about to die, so yeah. That is a bedroom, no one inside there, that, I have no idea whose bedroom that is, so. Um, is this the kitchen here? I think it is. Yeah, that's the kitchen, and that is another bedroom. As you can see, they are really big. I think, well, my bedroom has like 15 people, so that kind of shows you how big that is. Uh, that's the lobby area, and this is the reception. Uh, there's no one there at the moment. And as you can see, it's like a Japanese house. You have to take off your shoes and put on your slippers. So this area to the right here is where we take off our shoes, and we put them in this wardrobe cupboard thing and the entrance to the hotel is actually through that door there but there's a meeting going on so unfortunately I cannot show you the front now but if we just go upstairs my room is on the left so I'm sharing it with 14 other people but our room is split into two so one room has nine people the other room has six and what else okay well just here quickly we are room number eight as you can see so the first thing we do when we walk into the room is we have to take off our slippers and we just walk around in socks. So I'll just quickly show you down here. So yeah, as you can see, that's where we put all our slippers because we don't walk around as a tummy mouth with slippers. Uh, next is the bathroom. Uh, there are two sinks there and in here is the toilet. Um, there's no shower or bath in the bedroom. We have to go downstairs and have showers and then go into the offador afterwards. So yeah. Um, this is the section of the room I'm staying in. There are nine of us in this room. It's very messy because there isn't much storage space. Uh, we eat we eat all our meals on the tables as well here, so everything's brought in. On, we eat on that table. Usually there are two tables. I don't know why there's one there. I think one of them has gone somewhere. But anyway, so we sleep on futons on the tatami mats. So if I just quickly show you here, at the bottom we have the futons, and then we put the sheets on top of the futons, and then we sleep with the duvet. And every night we take them out, and in the morning we put them away. Um, through here is another bedroom with six people, not very interesting. And yeah, that is all to see, so thanks for watching.